Hassan Ali Saeed has come a long way in 3x3 basketball, and much of that is owed to his adopted homeland of Qatar. Saeed, one of the main reasons behind the big quarterfinal win against Amamatsu, knew the sport in Senegal, but it was very different there. You know how to run and jump. You know how to play basketball. That's how it is back home. But when you get here, you got to learn quick. And learn the nuances and tactics of 3x3 he did in Qatar. Saeed plays five on five too, but his natural talent and skill have also made him a nice fit in 3x3. He's gotten the chance to do both for Qatar and has had a huge impact on his career. It took me maybe like half a year for them to naturalize me. And then uh, since then, I've been playing for the national team, which is a great opportunity from where I'm coming from. For 14 years, I've been playing for the national team. And uh, there is nothing better than somebody opening the door for you, welcome you, and then take you like one of them. I feel like I'm home. Qatar is sure glad that Saeed is one of them. He helped them win the 2014 3x3 World Championships, something they did by beating juggernaut Serbia in the final. Saeed was amazed by the reaction he and his teammates got back in Qatar. After we won and we come back, we came back early morning and everyone, they were at the airport. I mean, people from the Federation, fans. It was so surprising for us for Qatar in the basketball to win something like that, it was a really big, big thing for the country. I don't think they ever win anything that big in the, in the country. The 2014 triumph served as inspiration for other basketball players in Qatar. The under-18 team achieved an amazing double this year, winning both the U18 Asian Championships and the U18 World Championships. The 2.2 meter big man knows that his team's success, both on the world tour and internationally, has been a platform to build on for 3x3 in Qatar. Tier on three is growing in Qatar. It's really growing. Club teams, they have their teams. Each generation, they come with different way of playing, different mindset. So right now, we're in the learning process. They're learning from us, we're learning from them. The team is growing slowly but we're hoping for the best in the future. The future is the kids.